marriage is a legal or customary union between two people of whom one or both spouses is below the age of 18. It is a global phenomenon which has many negative consequences for girls and these include gender-based violence, birth complications, vulnerability to HIV. Girls who are forced into child marriage are denied of their chance to access education and they find themselves in a cycle of poverty. Like many other girls, Forget was forced into child marriage after she got pregnant. Forget is not the only girl in this predicament. Eunice also went through the same experience. But it is not just a sad story in Zimbabwe. Two former child brides approached the Zimbabwe Constitutional Court challenging the country's marriage laws, which allowed girls to be married before they reached the age of 18. This led to the ban of child marriage. Following the landmark victory, a celebration march was held. Government, churches and other like-minded stakeholders were part of it. champions and because they are champions we are going to work with them to ensure that whatever they need in their lives to ensure that the rest of the women of the young girls are liberated Mad, Mad, but traditional leaders in this country the custodians of culture are saying it is an culture it is not in our culture to marry children under the age of 18 years the question still remains, is the law sufficient to end child marriage in Zimbabwe? The stories of Forget and Eunice show there is need for poverty alleviation, address of social norms that drive child marriages, promotion of girls' education, social and economic empowerment of girls, including those in child marriages, and awareness raising. <laughs>